Hey there guys, it's me again, and I've realised something today, which is um, that the Logitech G920 uh, driving wheel has an issue on the uh, seemingly popular game with the speed. Now this issue is something that I heard about first from a friend, well, from a friend I mean, rather, when he tried to play the game, and at first I thought it might just be an issue with his game and then when I came to play the game the day after being today I realised that it didn't work for me either and all my other friends have a different wheel like a G27 or a G29 uh, but it worked for them straight away so I'm trying to think what happened and why can't I f get it to work so if you're like me you'll have come here and everything will be like this or it'll be something like this I've changed some of the settings uh, I just changed back what uh, what you need to do to get the shift to work. Um, so you'd go into a game, you'd go, I don't know, let's just go into training here and test drive the GTI. And um, you can rev your engine. You can try and change gear. But you see that nothing actually happens. You just keep revving in neutral. So you go back to your options here. Um, and the way that I fixed this was I went into options and I went into control. So I was fiddling around for a, w for a while. First thing you need to realize you need to do is put this on shifter. If that's something you haven't already done straight away, something you realize you need to do. Uh, and then have your clutch on axis also, not button, unless you're not using the pedals, which I don't understand why you wouldn't be. But yeah, so put that on axis, put that on shifter. So then you'll be fiddling around in here, so one thing you should do is come in here and you should set it so you reverse, you'd, you'd press down and then press down, go into 19, fourth, and just set this now. Um, 16, there we go. Um, seventh, don't have the seventh gear so I'm not going to worry about that. Uh, but one thing that I didn't realise is that we need to be on axes. Now, one thing you'll notice is right here, it shows you, um, this, this is the clutch. So if you press down on your throttle, you see that go up there. If you press down on your brake, you'll see it go up there. But if you press down on your clutch, nothing will happen there. But as you can see in here, in the available axes, your clutch actually does register for the game. It's just not on the right thing. So simply, all you have to do is axis, click that, and then click 4 here, axis 4. Then as you'll see, it now works. Once you set everything up, you can go back into the training, go into your test drive, go, and then first. Thank you for watching. I hope this has helped some people because I couldn't find something online about it, and I'd like to wish you all a very good evening.